it pull out again. Um, I'm going to do a short run to Indiana and back. Uh, beat that snow back home. Not going to be a lot of snow, but we got some other things that need our attention at the end of the week. So we're just going to do a quick out and back. With diesel now at 510 a gallon. Probably do a lot more shorter trips. Seven, eight hundred mile trips are probably gonna be out of the question. We'll see what happens. I look for uh, depending on what happens. Ukraine. I think diesel hits uh, six dollars by the end of the month. But we'll have to wait and see. Right now we're heading to Perrysville, Cowan. It's my favorite uh, brokers and distribution uh, logistics company. Good people. And over to pick up a load of plumbing. Going to Indianapolis. We get there, we'll get back to you. Alright, picking up at Cowan. We were a third truck. Um, there's Spotter's pulling out now, so as soon as he pulls out, I'm gonna back in and basically what they do, they cross dock. They pick up loads at Mansfield Plumbing and they just set them in the lot here and then when they need them shipped out. What's this guy doing? He's dropping that trailer. It's a day cab, so he's probably dropping that. That's probably my load. Yep, as soon as they air up, I'm going to put her in the dock. We'll see what happens. Should be bidets. But people like to panic in my toilet paper. Especially with uh, war with Russia. Really. Oh, yeah, I walk up here, get our paperwork. Watch your 
bit. Paperwork. Oh, stealing your pen. Put that back. That happens a lot. <laughs> Driver's stand and you just don't think about it. Oh, dropping my paperwork. What is going on here? Stuff together. Down the hill. See no fun after it's snowed about six inches and it's packed down. Real slippery. Let's get this seal put on. With the lock. Stop in the Anna. Get back to you. Get to the receiver. Alright. Made it to the receiver early this morning. Indianapolis traffic is horrible. And then once you get off 465. And I drove through about 10 roundabouts. I don't know. <laughs> I hate the roundabouts. <clears throat> Especially in the bigger cities where no one wants to, you know, have any patience with you. But this place is, it's a big place, big facility, but... Like just about all the other plumbing supply places we deliver to, they got stuff everywhere. I had to, uh, I'm in the last dock, so I had to pull up by the dumpster, which, you know, I had no kind of angle get back so I had a jacket and then those two hot water tanks were in my way trying to get under it and 20 minutes getting in the dock we're in it took the other guy longer yeah there was another truck here that and that poor kid was wore out by the time he got in the dock I mean he was just <laughs> on the wheel <laughs> just trying <laughs> He was farther down. But he had all the holes in front of him too. It's yeah. like they don't make it easy getting in these knots. Nope. It's not easy. But we're in, we got another load, Conagra. Going to Kroger in Delaware. And it picks up at 1.30, delivers nine o'clock tonight. Then we'll be heading home. I might take a nap in between somewhere. We'll see how it goes.